What's going on guys, Coach Matt here. I'm here at SPF Parkour Academy in Mesa and today we're gonna to be discussing the Lazy Vault. So the only progression you're gonna need for your Lazy Vault is your Step Vault. And if you don't have that, we have a video on the Step Vault right here as well as a link in the description. So you're gonna to wanna to start in your Step Vault position and get really strong here, okay? Bring that inside leg through and back. Once you feel comfortable there, transition from your step fault to a crab walk position, okay? Once you're able to go from monkey to crab efficiently, then you're ready to take it to an obstacle. All right, and for our obstacle, what we're gonna be doing is the same progression that we did on the ground. So we have our step fault position coming into a crab walk position, all right? Once more. Okay, so now to progress into our actual lazy vault, we're just gonna add a slight jump. So, whatever leg is closest to the block, that's gonna be my inside leg. That leg is gonna lead up and over, hop, crab walk position, right? So, now we're gonna bring it to a little higher obstacle and start to add a leg flare. So, inside leg is right here, close to the block. I'm gonna bring that up and have a seat. Okay, that's it. Again, pop up, have a seat. Now notice I'm splitting my legs in the air as my inside leg goes up, my outside leg is down, and then as my inside leg falls, my outside leg rises. Okay, this outside hand is gonna place for support. One more time all the way through. And that's your lazy ball. All right, so one thing about the Lazy Vault is that our inside leg is not always uh, in the perfect position to go over the block. And it might not always be our leg of choice, so we have to work at both sides. So make sure that you practice with your right leg inside as well as your left leg inside. Okay, and then we can also talk about the Thief Vault really quick. Our Thief Vault is when our outside leg goes over. All right, our outside leg is gonna go over first. And that's really important to also have because when we're running at the block, we oftentimes can't position our inside leg perfectly behind us to go over the block. So that looks like this. Okay, very similar, but just a slight modification there. Outside leg is going over first. All right guys, that concludes this week's video. If you want more content, check back next week. And if you want to find out some more information about our program or would like to sign up for a trial class, visit spfparkouracademy.com. And until next time, see you later, guys. Matt, take 5,000. Why did she leave me? Oh my God. I need more energy. Come on, I need more attitude. Come on, come on. There it is. Explosions. Children. It's okay.